Hello. Um, I was once talking to a philosophy student, and he suggested that God is not required for objective moral laws to exist. And he pointed this out when I was arguing with him. I basically said that um, since God created us, we are morally obligated to obey him, and therefore he's able to impose moral duties on us. But then he said that the fact that we are obligated to obey someone who creates us suggests a moral law that exists outside of God, and therefore there now, can be... Say, say that again. What suggests that the moral law exists outside God? Um, the principle that we are obligated to obey God since he created oh, us. Oh, I see. And so, he, and so the idea is that if that moral law can exist outside of God, then who's to say that other moral, moral laws don't exist outside okay, of God? Okay, you have asked a very profound question. Uh, I would refer you to the debate that I had with Professor Eric Wielenberg uh, recently. It's on YouTube about the foundation of objective moral values and duties. And I would say two things in response to this. First of all, it may well be the case that any moral view will have its explanatory stopping point, its ultimate, uh, which, um, beyond which you cannot go. There will be simply an, an explanatory ultimate. And what I would say is that God is a less arbitrary and more plausible explanatory stopping point than anything else the atheist can su suggest, such as the flourishing of sentient life, the flourishing of human beings. On atheism, those stopping points are arbitrary and, I think, premature. Whereas when you get to God, you've reached a metaphysical ultimate beyond which you cannot go, and so it is a more plausible explanatory stopping point. The second thing, though, I think I would say is this. Suppose you say that the reason we should obey God's commands is because he has commanded us to. In other words, God's commands are self-inclusive. If God has said, obey all that I command you, then that is itself something that he has commanded us. And so it would be comprised in itself. And it seems to me that this is a perfectly legitimate justification for uh, saying why we should obey God, because he has commanded us to, and he, um, our moral duties are constituted by his commands. So I think it's a kind of self-inclusive or self-justifying um, stopping point. Thank you. Good question.